An Omaha homicide case is on the verge of going cold. 18 year old Eric Valencia was killed last fall. Now, three and a half months later, his family still racked with grief, not knowing who did it. They hope a $25,000 Crime Stoppers reward will help. Whoever did, they broke my heart. It's heartbreaking to hear. Norma and Albaro Garcia, for the first time, talking about life without their oldest, 18 year old Eric Valencia. I miss those times. He come from work and always smile. Always with the big old smile. No matter what, he got the biggest smile. Eric was found murdered the last weekend of October. His body near 78th in Miami in a parked and locked Hummer. The vehicle was totally locked and, it, uh, and, and we never found the keys to the car. Now, homicide detective Larry Cahill's trying to unlock this case. There's not a lot to go on. He won't say how Eric was killed, but he can now tell us how many people may have been with him. We do believe that there was at least two people inside the vehicle besides Eric Valencia. Another lead he tracked, an incident three months earlier. Eric was with some people in this apartment when one played a deadly game of Russian roulette. Detective Cahill checked for any connection. There were some early leads that had stated that they might be connected. Um, we couldn't uh, confirm any of those any of those leads. Another lead, Eric's many friends, an outgoing guy. He moved in several circles. Well, now while detectives are going through those, the Garcias are going through old photos. But it's incredibly hard for them to picture better days, not knowing if they have the strength to go on. I don't know if we're gonna make it, you know, because. It's really, really hard for us. Even harder because Eric dearly loved his little sister and brother. And the last day they saw Eric alive was supposed to be a day of celebration. We were in for him that day. It was my daughter's birthday. <laughs> we waited. He never came back. <laughs> he never came back. And his devastated family still waits. But now, they wait for someone to ease their heartache. <laughs> if somebody knows something, say something, <laughs> help us. $25,000 in cash is available for tips in this case. Remember, there were two others in that vehicle. Maybe one of them didn't kill Eric and can anonymously say what happened. Or maybe one of his friends knows something. No tip is too small, and they all go through a code system so maybe you can get that huge reward and help a grief-stricken family. These tips really do pay off. Crime Stoppers board just approved nearly $39,000 in payouts for January alone.